this is the most exciting announcement that I've gotten to make in the entire cabinet, raising this to a cabinet-level position in one case. These are among the brightest, most dedicated people, not only in the country, but the world. As the Presidential Science Advisor and Director of the Office of Science and Technology Policy, I nominated one of the most brilliant guys I know, persons I know, Dr. Eric Lander. And thank you, Doc, for coming back. Uh, the pioneer, in, in this, he's a pioneer in the scientific community, principal leader in the Human Genome Project. It's not hyperbole to suggest that Dr. Lander's work uh, has changed the course of human history. And I came to appreciate Dr. Lander's extraordinary mind when he served as the co-chair of the President's Council on Advisors in Science and Technology during the Obama-Biden administration. And I'm grateful. I'm grateful we can work together again. I have uh, always said that the Biden-Harris administration will also going to lead, and we're going to lead with science and truth. We believe in both. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> the president-elect knows that science and technology will be crucial in meeting this moment. And he has tasked us in this letter I don't mean just his scientific advisors. I mean the whole scientific community and the American public with answering important questions about how science and technology can best be used to advance our health, our economic welfare, and our national security. He's asked us to rise to this moment 